Why do glass windows break during a fire? You might have noticed in movies and also in real life that whenever there is a fire inside a building, the glass windows that are there, they crack and they break. Unfortunate incidents like compartment fires are known to cause the breaking of glass. This happens due to a very interesting reason. So why does this happen? Let's discuss in today's episode. But before we begin, if you are new to the channel and if you like the video, do consider subscribing to the channel as it's a very small channel and every subscription or every like helps the channel grow. The openings of the windows in the walls of a room on fire play a key role in the spread of fire. Windows are those part of the building that generally have less resistance to fire in comparison to walls. During a rising compartment fire, there is an increase in temperature inside the room. The glass pane is not subjected to uniform heat from the compartment fire. The region of the pane that succumbs to heat the most is the central region. As a result, the center of the pane is hotter than the rest. Thus, the heat waves from the fire create a heat gradient across the planar dimensions of the pane. Different regions of the glass pane experience differential heating, which is why it is called non-uniform heating. Glass windows are fitted within frames and the thickness of the frame is larger in comparison to the glass pane. During a fire, there is an intense heat flux that is suddenly experienced on one side of the glass pane. As a result, there is a sharp thermal gradient created across the thickness of the pane. This rapid heating caused by fire is called thermal shock, whereas the deep gradient created is called the thermal stress. Thermal stress causes the panes to break. As mentioned, the thickness of the frame is greater than that of the pane. During a fire, thermal stress is focused on the center region of the pane and the fire transfers thermal heat as thermal radiation onto the glass pane. The edges or rims are shielded away from radiation and convective heating. The edges lose energy or heat into the frame by conduction through the pane. As a result, the heat focused on the center region of the glass causes it to expand while the edge of the pane happens to be relatively cooler and this induces stress in the material. This shifting gradient is known to cause the breakage of glass. Even in case of uniform heating or when the glass window experiences a uniform thermal load, the sides of the panes of the glass remain relatively cooler. This is because the heat from the sides would dissipate into the thicker window frames rendering the sides cool. Also note that the cracking of the glass happens before the breakage. Not all glass windows break at the same temperature, different types of glass have different thermal resistance capabilities. That is the reason that the glass of your oven or the glass of a microwave does not break even in extreme heat. This is because they have been specially treated and made resistant to temperature. Apart from the earlier mentioned aspects, factors like window size, heat vents, glass coating, shading patterns, glass defects and planar temperature gradient are also known to affect the breakage of glass due to fires. If you learned something new today, don't forget to share this video with your family and friends. If you like the video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and comment in both YouTube and Facebook. The channel needs your support to grow. Thank you.